Welcome to Frico Plays Rome Total War 2 in God Mode. This is Athens 2 edition. Episode number 4, The Greek Campaign 4. And, it, and now we're into the Pannonia Campaign. The Battle of Singadun. This is what we're fighting, folks. This is what we're doing. This is where it's at. The Battle of Singadun is where... We open our Pannonian campaign. We must take Pannonia if we are to make it to, well, <clears throat> well, we're, we're, we're trying to make our way to, 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 to Sarmatia is what we're trying to make our way to. And I'm hoping by the end of this episode, we get the battle done and then we get at least to the footsteps of Sarmatia. That's my hope, but we'll see. Cause we 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 have some brutal slogging ahead of us, even in the auto resolve verse. It's gonna be tough slogging ahead, folks. Tough slogging ahead. So here we go, the Battle of Singadun, and this is where we're going to have our general. Well, actually, he's a. I guess he's a Basilius, whatever that is. And it's uh, Cr Cremonides, and he is a siege expert. And I, I programmed him to be a siege expert. No, no, he just chose that on his own. I would never say that. <coughs> I didn't make him. He made himself. And he's looking to prove his worth and build his rank. Uh, uh, and so this is a big D, big, big, big deal for him. So let's see how this upstart does. Wow, I can't believe they didn't have any kind of... That's... Here we go. If every man is a hero, prepare for action. Wow. Well, we're already getting our missiles off, <coughs> as you can see. And the basic strategy, as, as, as it's been told to me by Cremonides, is he, he has his, his foot soldier dudes up front. So these are his... What are these? The Citizens Cavalry. Well, this is Citizens Cavalry. They're waiting. They're waiting to pounce on anyone that ventures outside this wall. So they're waiting to descend. These are archers in towers <coughs> that are heading toward the walls to take the walls. Then he has his uh, his his heavy onagutters back here, just targeting the walls. Now. I think that he made a bit of a mistake here, and I think a lot of people are gonna cite him for this because these are these aren't really these are earthworks, and I'm not sure that heavy onagers are heavy against earthworks, but but you can use them to take the towers out. So if I'm gonna look at Cremonides, I'm gonna say right from the start that is we'll see we'll see how he progresses, but that would be a little bit of a. <coughs> A little bit of a concern, but we'll see how this plays out. We'll see how this plays out because he is getting his, getting these guys up here now. Oh, he's got his. Uh, oh, I see what he's doing. Since he could see, I guess. Now he's got these guys up too close with his archers, <clears throat> so that's a problem. That that would be a concern <clears throat> that I would level with him. Also, his archers. Obviously, nobody's going to come up and threaten this right now. Why aren't you moving your archers down and get them in the fight? That's just, that's that's bad. Not cool with that. But then again, I think he did have another mission in mind going in. That is right. I forgot. the 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 idea is not <clears throat> not to 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 win maximally, but to to win with as little as you have gradually and and to choke. And it's a it's meant to be a psychological warfare against our enemies so there's plenty of people who are going to survive and we're okay with that and they'll run off and they'll report our methodologies the ruthlessness of which we pursue life and uh, i think with that let's see how these guys do oh yeah go get these get these little straggler guys see they didn't really get to use the, 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 honestly, the cavalry didn't do much here. I don't even know what you're doing. Why are you just standing here? Well, we got that going on. Whoa. Now that's cool. That is pretty cool. 
Uh-huh. <sighs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. I'm, I'm glad I'm here right now just checking this out. But you know what? You know where I'd rather be right now? I think you'd rather be. Let's let's go watch these guys land. Get this landing. Come on, guys. What are you doing? What are you doing? Um, nothing. 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 Wow. I mean, you guys are in it. You guys are in it. There's no doubt about that. I'm not sure what your plan is here. Oh boy, Cremonides, what what do you plan on doing? These guys are on the walls. All right, <clears throat> all right. I can't believe how massive this 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 settlement is. Just massive. I'm gonna convert this settlement nicely, though. I'm gonna tell you that. I'm gonna tell you that this settlement gonna be fine. This settlement gonna be fine, kids. Gonna be fine. Oh, look at that. Oh gosh. Yeah, I, I, I think that you can can. Oh, they kind of broke that. Well, no, they didn't break that down. There. What the heck are you guys doing? Let's see. Can I get your perspectives? Let's see. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. That was rough. What was that? Oh. Come on, you guys. What? Look, you're down, and then you pop up, but why aren't you attacking? I'm very upset with this, this Cremonides. I'm telling you, Cremonides, look, look. Uh, I mean, there's patience and all that. I guess that's what you're being. I, I'm going to just give him that. I think that's what he's doing. He's just, he just holding back way more than he normally would. Just, just for sport. I think that's what it is. So I'm going to give him slack. I think that's what it is. I'm just, I'm a little bit flabbergasted, but I think I don't want to judge. I think I'm going to be a good, I want to be a good king, King Frico. The Athenian King Frico. Just never did anything to that. So, so I, I, I don't know about this. Probably should have brought, well, they're right there. These guys, they're still, they're now coming up. So that's good. I mean, <clears throat> I mean, he is just kind of picking them off and letting them kind of come to him. I think that's what he's doing. And remember, he knows, like I do, he knows that we are godlike, that we are, you know, we're in God mode. We're God mode warriors because of the secrets that we hold, which we cannot relate to you, mere mortals. But the thing is, when these guys, the ones that live, and they become part of our crew, they're going to be with us, man. And, 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 and once you're in, you never want to leave. These guys are these guys are leaving. Well, oh, wait. Oh, this is nice. Look at that. I'm sorry. I'm just going to say this. When you see guys that are well-armed, like these guys are well-armed, right? And they're running away. Now, check out the guys that are running towards the action. Check this out. I, you know what? These guys deserve their own part of the movie. Definitely. Well, oh, oh, I lost them. Where are they at? Oh, come on. Where are they at? There they are. All right. Come on. Quickly, quickly. There they are. There they are. These guys. Somehow, when they saw those guys, they still ran towards the fight. Give mad props to these guys. That's courage. I'm telling you. That's like you see, like, people with, like, I don't know, I'll just say automatic weapons and they're running away from you and you're running toward the fight with 22s. I mean, oh, oh, what's going on in that massive back there? Come on, you guys, what's up? How you doing? I can't believe you guys, you know? Brave men, brave men, brave men. When those other guys cowered away, these men stood, stood. I just say they stood. But it doesn't look great for them because, look, they just got, oh, gosh. They got artillery shells firing. Yeah. <clears throat> now, I did instruct them to use the fire, even though it is less effective. It's just because of the visual, so this isn't on him. 
It's beautiful, though. Beautiful. Wonderful. And these men are so brave. Just awesome, guys. I wish we could find those guys deserters, because that's shameful. These guys, I want them to join us if they live. I doubt that you're going to live, but who knows? At some point, you got to give up the ghost and run, dudes, so that you can join us later. That's cool. Whoa! Oh, oh never mind. That's there, guys. I was worried for them. I thought I thought I was attacking. <laughs> I don't want to attack. Oh yeah, I do. But I do. But I mean, I am. I mean, we're shelling these guys, and they're still. They're just like, I'm here. <clears throat> I don't even care. Look at that. Oh, I don't know. Oh, are you still trying to hit? Are you still trying to hit the gate? See, if you're still trying to hit the gate, I'm like, oh, you don't need to hit the gate anymore because we're in. Oh, wow. We broke in. We broke in. We broke in. Look at this. We broke through finally. We made a mad rush. I'm going to look at what these guys have to say. Uh, uh, what are we doing? Holy moly. You look over. You're over here. You see that on the other side <clears throat> and you're running towards us. These these guys deserve a mention. This 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 community, this Singadon community is a proud proud community. I'm gonna do them well in the rebuild. I'm gonna take care of these people after I murder them. Watch me. Watch them grow. Watch them grow. That is gonna be the motto. When we come in to fix everything, we're going to put that everywhere. Watch them grow. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What's going on? Oh, gosh, they're getting mauled right now. That's us. I feel bad for you guys. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm doing this to you, but I have to. It's for your own good. Well, not your good, but other people's good that look like and stuff like you. Anyway. Anyway, I think... I think it's near the end, folks. As you can see, we, we, we basically have the city. There's, there's, there's pockets. You got these guys. These guys are running away. You got these guys. These guys are running in. Let's see how far they get. I love this. I love doing this. We're running along and we're running in the log. Oh, we're going to die. Where are they going to take them? They're, they're still running in. Oh, 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 they stopped here. That's it. They got them in reserve. What are they going to do? Wow. Chaos, man. Chaos. How, how are they managing all this? Who's, who's putting the arrows on who? Who is arrowing people? Is that us? These my guys or your guys? I don't even know. These are your guys, right? Because they'd be attacking them, right? Oh, they're throwing missiles. That's what it is. And, and what's happening here? So far, they're like, nobody's noticing us. Nobody's not. We're fine. Everybody's fine. Nobody's noticing us. Everything's going to be fine. You know what? Let's... Let's, uh, you know what? I want to keep it on these guys, though. But uh, let's, uh, let's speed. No, no, let's just see what's going on here. Because uh, I'm kind of enjoying watching these guys trying to duke it out and live. I'm, I'm, I'm going to go back to where I was. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Well, there are the missiles going off. There are those, those coming in. There's that tower where they can. And there it is, I think. There it is. There it is. I thought it was going to happen anytime. That's a good view of it. Hey, those guys lived. Those guys are going to be recruited. Everybody, listen, all of you that feel bad for the brave Singadundians, and I don't blame you. I feel bad. I feel bad when I, some people put up a fight and, and, and you know, who was it? It was, it was the unarmed naked compared to the big brawling, <clears throat> Those big brawlers, man. No, no, don't worry. We'll keep them, too. I'm, we need them. But I'm just saying, kind of, a, kind of a dick move. When they ran away, 
Now, my report on uh, commodities, I would say commodities. I'm going to give you a B, B, a solid B. Uh, this isn't a rising star. You need to do something far more amazing. This is like you're, you're, you're a superstar guy and you're up against some sort of journeyman kind of gatekeeper kind of guy. You're 7-0 you're and 0, and he's 23-12, and 12, but he's had a couple of title shots, never won the title. And you you beat him and you knock him out in the ninth round, but it's kind of boring and you kind of slogged your way through. And although this wasn't boring, this was fun to watch. It was fun. It was. But uh, uh, in in terms of tactics and yeah, that that part that part, Mister Commodities, I'm a little bit I'm a little bit. But but that's okay. That's okay. I respect you, and I think you did a solid job. And and you did have a very specific mission. I'm sure that that if the mission was just to to just do whatever you could to win as quickly and if, as possible and we weren't doing what we're doing our program that we're doing now which is the psychological warfare to make everybody just cry when they even think about possibly ever 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 coming up against us they would they would remember the broken hearts of, of those who watch their lives slowly get strangled to death mercilessly without pause in a slow methodological grind. That's what we're doing here, folks. Now, I want to give you guys a payoff here because I think that these Singadundians are worth it. Because you could see they're just minding their business. They didn't need the Athenian Empire all up their butts. And uh, I respect that. And so watch Ready what I'm going to do for them. Watch what I'm going to do for the Singadonians. Look, look at this, right? You see this? See this right here? Boom, Paulus. Watch this, right? We're going to have to we're going to have to break that down for us. Uh, this one, you're okay. Don't worry. We're going to we're going to we're going to get you going. We're going to get you build some nice uh, siege workshop. Oh, you can build a workshop. Definitely going to do that. And uh, let's see. Uh, let's go with Musterfield, and I don't know which direction we're going to take there. We'll have to decide when we when we get to it. But for right now, there you go, Singadon. You're definitely going to have to be a military powerhouse. So I'm hoping that I'm hoping you expand. I don't know if that happens. <laughs> I was hoping you were a sixer, a sixer. I wanted six squares, not five. So there, you guys can see. I'm going to take care of the Singadonian. Now, now here's the next challenge. Next challenge is this. I'm going to take my defense. I'm going to leave the defense guy in here. Nope. Hold on. I got to do this first. Hold on. Taking this guy out. And I'm putting the defense guy in. And then I'm going to move him on over to... Yeah, we're going to go here next. And we're going to put you into this as well. I just want to have overwhelming force. And I believe I'll need overwhelming force for some of these things. Because you see how huge they are. And I really don't want to do all these battles in here. This is not. Definitely not. A, a, yeah. No. Especially. Yeah. I'm just saying. I have goals in life. And, and it doesn't include a whole bunch of battles in here. So let's hope that this gives us our overwhelming force that we need. And we could just use At this guy. Command. It doesn't matter. Uh, you know what? I want to make sure Commander. I'm closer. All right. Let's, let's, let's get you attacking. How about that? Let them power like All right. Let's see. Oh, okay. Let's see. Yes. All right. Now. Well, now we've taken Anik. All right. So now the defense guy is going to go. Well, well, hold on. You go here. Ready for battle. Ready for further orders. So the we defense guy is going to go back here. And now we got these two guys. See see my nice little system? Tell me my nice little system isn't nice. Now we got these two guys to bring up. So we're going to bring those two guys up to Segestica. And Segestica is the last city of Pannonia. That is all. Let me get this other guy here. Well, we have three guys to Ready bring up orders. here. March. 
And come on. See, I'm leaving these defensive guys behind, and uh, and then, well, you'll see what happens. What what hopefully happens. And we bring you on up. So I'm going to bring this guy up. Now we, <laughs> now I'm bringing all these guys up here, not just to totally pick on Segestica, but I'm just going to stage here and figure out where we're going to go next because it's. We basically have on, well, we're going to have, I think, four armies. So we're going to have two pairs that we can take to two cities. Well, you'll see. There's a method that we're going to be doing. And hopefully we'll be able to maximize our units and have everything garrisoned up in initially. So I don't have to deal with stuff in the later turns. So let's get... Let's see how much of these guys Ready show up and, and annihilate this guy. This Wait a second. That's, uh... All right. Let's see. All right. Very high. Here we go. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. It's okay. Now, let's take stock of our situation. And our situation is this. We have... We have Thracia? Are we just taken Pannonia? Now, we need to move over to Dasha. Uh, uh, Dasha. So we need to go to Apuli. So wait, hold on. Let me, let me mark one of my... Guys, whoops. One of my guys. Let's see. Who am I on? I'm on my SGs. Ready for orders. Got an SG-1. All right. The SG-1 is lit. Okay. And then we're going to go up to... Where are we at here? Opoli. So we're going to Opoli. And there we go. Let's make sure that that is Opoli. And it is. So we are going to go... Basically, we're going to Advance. immediately At assault once. this place to see if it's possible, if it's an easy get. Waiting and you know what? Orders. I see an army here, At so once. I am going to try to battle this army first Lord. before I battle the city, because I don't even want to... Yes, declare war. I do not need your help, but I appreciate it. Thank you, my brothers and sisters, all of you. Everyone. Oh, young warriors crave they oh, oh well, you, a pulley should join you because because I'm a. Uh... Oh my gosh, yes. Yeah, this is a death for these guys. Not even slavery. Remember, remember, we we do slavery now. In in the Greeks, uh, that's our model. Last time we did death. Today we did slavery, or this series we do slavery, and I think we'll we may end up. I don't know if we'll do one more Athenian one or not. I'm, I haven't decided. All right, let's see. Out of resolve. Oh my! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Break siege. Okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna have you go. Well, I'm gonna have you stay here. So that's a lot of guys. I also see that you got you over here. So let's. Yeah, I don't care. Now, remember, I'm only going to have 48% of my force left, except that I'm not because I'm... Because basically, if auto-resolve doesn't finish off my unit, I fully recover my force. So you imagine some of my forces, there are a lot of people who have lived and died. Uh, probably going to be a lot. It's kind of horrifying if you think about the kind of life that you led. When you're part of uh, part of such, all right. Let's see what it says. The auto resolve will be. No, no, we're still at close defeat. But hey, we're getting closer. So let's. Uh, I tell you what, let's continue siege for now, and let's go to our our troopers here. Let's get SG. Let's get SG two on up here. So SG two. Yeah, where are we at? 
where did we go here? Uh, I think here. Nope. Yeah, yeah, here. Okay, so let's get her on up. Oh. Let's get her on up there. So we're just waiting for you to, to ride on in. And uh, then I'm going to have you be the one to lead the assault. Oh, I'm going to upgrade you before I get you up, though. Look at that. We got to upgrade our general here. Or, or Oh, this is our Basilius. Oh, this is Cremonides. This is the guy that was just... Uh, in uh, the Battle of Singadon. Oh, wow. All right, all right. You know what? Let's give you another chance here. You know what? You know what? I tell you what. Where we got? We got here. We got we got artillery experts. Uh, artillery experts. Oh, yeah. We're going to go with artillery experts because this is what he is. So let's go with that. You got anything else I can do for you? Nope. Let's go back to your military units and let's see if we can upgrade anyone. No, we can't upgrade anyone. Well, well that sucks. Okay, so let's get you trying to assault. That is impossible. You know why it's impossible? Because you gotta, you gotta go to here. Battle! No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Don't, 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 Ready don't worry. You, you can come right back up here. We cannot do that. I'm afraid we cannot. We hunger All right. battle. Laying siege to the settlement. All righty then. We've got these guys. We have our our catapults. So, yeah. guess what? I didn't plan on this, but listen. This is this is a really good campaign for Cremonides to run, so I kind of have to do this because He's got to learn, and he's got to get better, and I think that in this thing, well, what we're going to do is we're going to hunker down. We're going to give him another uh, uh, opportunity. Oh, we can't, we can't give him all we can have is siege engines or our, our ladders. That's all he gets for this one, so that's, that's unfortunate. But I'm looking here, and these are earthen walls, and he has ballistas. So I'm going to be interested to see how he handles this. I think it would be a real challenge for him. So this is what we're going to get ready for in the next in the next episode. So there you go. <laughs> I can't believe this. So thank you for joining us here on Preco Plays Rome Total War 2 in God Mode, the Athens 2 edition. And this is the this is the Greek campaign for Pannonia campaign, the Battle of Singadun. So we didn't get to conquer all of Pannonia we still have to well 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 actually we did conquer Pannonia what am I saying we did conquer Pannonia but then we went out and our our, our first next battle here is uh, is dealing with a, an enemy that uh, well it, it basically it gives our our up-and-coming possible star uh, Cremonides opportunity to, 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 to test his metal and see if he could figure this thing out. So that that's what we're going to go work on. Now I do want to let the Patreon people know that for this battle I'm not going to do I'm not going to do a Patreon version of the battle for every battle. And this is kind of probably be a quick battle and then we'll go resume our conquest. So there won't be a Patreon episode for this one. 